My biggest takeaway from the Modron Requirement 3 was it's kind of a, a two piece, right? There's there's a part that is really meticulous and you really have to read the lines to understand the requirements that a company or a business has uh, regarding the cardholder information, right? So what they have on file and then what's actually being done with the data may be two different things. The other part is, is that it's also just a little bit simple. There's not much effort when you think about it. If you just try to encapsulate it all and you realize the goal here is to protect customer data. So you can really apply common sense type methodology and really be like, I mean, let's be honest. What information would you not want to get out into other people or strangers' hands, you know, or even malicious hands? What kind of information would you want to keep secure? And so having that type of uh you know, common sense mindset really helps me to look at this and think, be sensible about this. It's not going to be something out of, out of this world. You know, it's going to be something simple, such as masking my credit card data information, not tracking my pin, not keeping my CVV. Um, so that's my takeaway. Thank you.